The agent will come soon. You need to hide or grab suspicious items. The original plan? Oh, wait, wait, wait. The original plan's still there. If he- Oh, there he is! Ooh. Uh, turn. Bless the president! Oh, look at your voice, Slick. Alright, welcome to 2020, the game. Uh, otherwise known as, uh, Mr. Prepper. This is indeed a demo, but I'm calling this 2020 the game because... Let's be honest here, 2020's been terrible. <laughs> it's been absolutely horrible. At this point, all that's really missing now is a giant mushroom cloud like that over here in the background. And Mr. Prepper is all about preparing yourself for the nuclear apocalypse. Essentially creating your own bunker down below in order to save yourself whenever, well, bombs start to drop and... And we are back at your place of residence, citizen. Don't I have a name? Mm -hmm. I'm Mr. Prepper. For an attempted escape, we have confiscated your vehicle. This is a standard procedure. Mm. Excuse me? Obviously, you are also prohibited from buying or registering a new... Mm. The agency expresses hope that you will not attempt to leave Murricaville again. That sounds about right. <laughs> oh, sure. Now I plan to fall back in love with this beautiful town. This is a commendable attitude, citizen. From today onwards, you are also on probation. I will come for a brief inspection every day to check for any subversive actions or items. This is a standard procedure. I am sure you will comply, and my visits will only be a formality. Bless the president! Ah, of course. Bless. Bless him indeed. So we tried to escape, and we got got. This is what happened here. Tutorial. This is a tutorial. Let me show you around. Go right ahead. Tutorial. I need to learn. Your boy needs to learn. Okay. I, I move by myself, if you don't mind. <laughs> Get familiar with the basics, camera. Yep. Got it. Simplistic. Gotcha. Move Mr. Pepper. See, I moved him before you even told me about that, so I figured that one on my own. Two times to run. Hmm. I getcha. I feel you. Feels like he's running no matter what, though. Uh, any object to see what you could do with them? Yeah, over here we can inspect this uh, little cabinet wardrobe. Hide something in it or turn it into wood. Ooh, so we could break stuff down in our apartment or, I guess, our house. <laughs> Sorry, I, I live in an apartment, so <laughs> everything to be is an apartment. Um, you were tired after your escape attempt. You deserve a nap. You're not wrong about that. So how do I get myself up there? Just do that. Okay. So you'd have to cook in the door. Just go upstairs and he'll run for you. I like how you actually kind of know that he's running back there because you see his little um, word bubble in the background. That's pretty cool. So let's go and have ourselves a little nampy poo. Big baby. What happened to your... Did they take my pillow as well? They took my pillow and my covers as well for trying to escape. See, now you've gone too far, I would say. It's one thing to escape, it's another thing to take a man's pillow. Doesn't seem so comfortable, hmm. I would say. You are hungry, go eat something. They probably took my food as well. You take a man's pillow, you might as well take his food as well. Be surprised if I find some booze in there too. Let's pop this open. Food only! Well, we'll see about that. I'll put whatever I want in there. You don't tell me what to put. Let's have ourselves some um, every... What does that say? Every prepper soup. Looks like very much like Campbell's, I would say, huh? Goal number one, survive. Okay. Hmm. Goal number two, escape. Hmm. Build the first room of my bunker. I have to build. Oh, that's... Seems fairly simple if you just stand around there with a blueprint. No manual labor involved. You need to graft a ladder for your bunker. First, uncover your trusty workbench. All right. I still want to get a snack. I'm going to tell you that much right now. The moment you leave me alone, I will have a snack. Uh, grab that. Oh. Oh. We were hiding it. Your workbench is a bit rusty. Let's see what you need to refresh it. You will need some metal and some wood. Start with buying eight units of metal. All right. So right now, we need to get our boy back in tip-top shape in order for us to hash our plan of escape. And apparently we buy stuff through here. Oh, we do everything through mail? That's also very similar to how things are nowadays. I mean, uh, you can't pay me to leave my, my apartment anymore. <laughs> if I have to go out, it's like, eh, I can eat groceries. You know what? I'll let Amazon take care of that. Hmm. So it's time for trade. Yes. Hmm. Make an order. Collect it in two hours. It is like Amazon. Hmm. That's how it should work. Okay, cool. Oh, oh. Sergey. Sergey. 
Not the most, um, typical name you'd probably see in Murricaville, right? But hey. Trading. You will need some metal and some wood. Start with buying eight units of metal. Alright. I can do that. Give me the old old show here. It's gonna cost me 32. We got 50. Traded. No, my trust went up to level 2 with this fella. Cool. We gotta wait two hours, yeah? Go to the forest and find some... what? I mean, they allow me to go to the forest here as well? I mean, I guess it's not too bad. You know, live in your house. And then you go to the forest every now and then on occasion to hunt. It's not a bad setup. Forest level 1-1. One, one. <laughs> what the hell is this? I wasn't expecting this. I thought the entire game would be in your house. Okay, What? what is this here? Oh, it's a big old giant uh, log. Cool. Go ahead and uh, grab this, I guess. He could pick this up by himself? That's a fairly strong-ass man. He could pick up two of them. I'm a little bit suspect about this guy that we're playing as here. Basically, he's over here hauling three three trees by himself at this point. Oh, how you doing back there, Bambi? Just hanging out, huh? Having a good time? Traps a loud area. Used for traveling between forest areas needs to... Re oh, really? So I guess that's why this was forest area one of one. And we repair that in the future. I guess he probably couldn't be, can do it in a demo, I'd imagine. But I suppose maybe in the future, you can repair it once the full game's out. And like travel from forest area to forest area. It's actually kind of cool. Disassemble three logs to get wood. <laughs> I don't have to disassemble logs to get wood, my friend. One log gives us five wood. It's fairly impressive. There it is. We could trust them. I will leave you a positive review by... Okay, so now with everything that we need... Is that to like double click or can I... I could just hold. Okay. I'm always constantly clicking on stuff. It's an LCD type of thing. Workbench level 1, crafted. Do you actually change look? Tell me you change look. Yeah, you do. Very good. You know what? This is giving me a lot of vibes and it just kind of dawned on me now when it should have probably dawned on me a long time ago. It reminds me of Shelter. It reminds me of Shelter, just instead of like, you know, underground. I mean, we're gonna be building underground, right? But above we have a nice house, and Shelter is like a complete wasteland above, and you're just building underground. But this reminds me a lot of Shelter. It's actually kind of cool. Took you that long, Falcon? Yes, it took me that long. It takes me... In my advanced stage in life, it takes me a lot longer to pick up on things, right? Um, time to place the ladder so I can go down to my bunk bunker. There we go. Okay. So... Um, can we remove ourselves from here and this is the ideal spot for us, would you tell me? I mean, I'd like to just be able to play the game on my own if that's okay, game, you know? Make a couple of decisions myself. Can I place it here instead? Okay, I'm gonna place it here instead, game. You don't tell me what to do at all times. You need lamps for your bunker, you need glass to make them. Let's disassemble something at the workbench. Oh. <laughs> so we use our own supplies to get glass, huh? That's cute. All right, let's go ahead and get this purple cup. I never liked you anyway. I never liked you anyway. It's from a... It's basically a leftover from a former relationship we were in. We have three. We got two purple cups and green cups. I, I don't know. I don't know where the hell this guy was shopping to get purple and green cups of glass, but hey. Let's go and um, craft. Sure. And we want to disassemble these boys. So, make that happen. Uh, wall lamp, yes. So one, yeah, it is a one-for-one one trade off at the very least. I guess since we have extra bit of glass, let's go and make a couple more. I mean, who's timing us, right? You mean other thing over here, Falcon? Yeah, I mean, that's timing us, sure, but... Don't rush me. Okay, we got three of them here ready to go. And... Uh, let's double click. Oh, just drag, right? Ooh, look at this. That's actually kind of cool. Um, I guess in the center would probably make the most sense, right? Get enough lighting in there? Sure. What covers the most? I guess that... That right there kind of covers most of it. So, we have lights in our bunker. It's no longer too spooky. Perfect. You need to go to sleep before 3 a.m. Oh. Okay. Sure. Go to sleep. 3 a.m. go to sleep, huh? Um... Y you know... Personally, 3 a.m. sleep for me... Um, rarely. You know, at 3 a.m. I'm probably thinking about going to sleep soon, maybe in an hour or two. You know, yeah, I'm, I'm a night guy. What can I say? So I get most of my stuff done. The agent will come soon. You need to hide or grab suspicious items. Oh. Oh. Okay. 
The original plan? Oh, wait, wait, wait. The original plan's still there. If he- Oh, there he is! Ooh. Uh, turn. Bless the president! Oh, look at your voice, Slick. Uh, cover? No, no. Grab the ladder. I like that we could just essentially, like, you know, install and uninstall that ladder whenever we feel like, and we should be- <gasps> What happened to my- my cover? Fine, grab that, too. I was hoping we could put the the blanket over that like we had it before, but apparently not. We could have covered the ladder, but not that, apparently. Well, you know what? We have enough time, do we? Yeah, I think that has to fill up. Give me a sec. Let's do this properly, then, if you don't mind. We'll set that up, and then we'll cover it. I want to see what this looks like. <laughs> you put a rug over it. That's cute. All right. Awesome. Hey, um, I didn't even open the door yet. Cool. Go ahead and... <laughs> Make yourself at home. Good morning to you, too. Meanwhile, you apparently invade my privacy completely. I'm just gonna have a sip of this. What is this? What the hell am I drinking today? Bang? Okay. I'm having some bang. Bang spokespeople! Just drop your name in the video if you want to hit your boy up, I'm just saying. Pretty good, actually. Nicolata. Alright. Hey, uh, buddy, you might want to hurry it up here. I got, I got stuff to do with this video still, you know. <laughs> Goodbye to you, too. A cheerful guy. Talks to you a lot and everything, huh? Investigation result, essential items lacking none. Suspicious items done. Next visit. Negative. Sure. Positive score, 5.0. All right. The government of America. Ah-ha! <laughs> you guys left it there. You guys forgot to put your America bill there. I mean, we all knew they were talking about America now, didn't we? Oh my, that was close. I have to be more careful. Indeed. Place the workbench in your bunker from now on, huh? Alright. Let's uncover our... This. So now this is a lot better. Now we're gonna have everything, all of our illegal items in one single area as opposed to all over the place. Can we also grab you? Yeah, we can. We should probably bring that ultimate plan down here as well. Can I, can I do that now? I mean... I'd like to do that now. Grab. There we go, you see? Have all the contraband in one single area. Now, some people would argue against that. Be like, you know, Falcon, if you ever get busted, all your contraband gets captured in one go. You're right. It's probably not a bad idea to have it spread out, but I mean... I'll forget to cover things and, you know, we'll be into trouble then. So, um, let's start off with the old workbench. Place you, like, right over there. The question now becomes, where the hell do I hang this something at? I guess we could do it over here, right? Okay, everything is in place. Time for my ultimate plan. I should start with checking my ultimate plan. Oh, that's your ultimate plan? Start by checking it out. Well, um, the problem is here that I have the ultimate plan, but I removed it, so can we all... I saw a momentary greenness. I'm not sure if you saw it, but I saw it. Oh, right there. It works! Yeah! All right, let's uh, read it. Establish a food source. Grow some plants in my bunker. I need a food source. Time to kick off my underground plantation. <laughs> The agent would not be happy to see that. To make your basic underground farm, you will need... Let me guess, seeds and soil? Room soil, oh, imagine that. Can be crafted into a workbench. You may find some in your home. Okay. Simple enough. Let's get our ass up above. Oh, look at that, we get a little bit of rain as well. Cool. Well, um... Where would we find some inspecting grab? We can't open that up. So, what is this, water? Receive water? Sure, I'll receive water. I received water. No, we're not cooking right now. Oh. Hey, look at that. Carrot seed and cabbage seeds. I'm sure all of you guys have a couple of, you know, bags of seeds laying around your house. Even if you don't have an actual farm outside. Ooh. More carrot seeds, beet seeds, bears, Battlestar Galactica. We'll take everything. So we have acquired the seeds. Now we need soil. Alright. So we should be able to make it from the workbench, it did say. However, do we have the requirements to make the soil? Would be the other good question. Room soil. It requires ground, which I guess we just have for some reason. Cool. We have exactly five that we do need. How convenient. It's almost like the tutorial set me up for success. Alright, so we have our patches. The only problem now is that... I don't want- I mean, I guess we have to dig more, right? Oh, your boy's hungry, too. Okay, hold on. Let's, um, come upstairs and grab a little bit of... 
the old snacky snacks here. I think I'm I'm feeling another another Campbell's soup to be honest with you. Let's uh, eat that. Very good. And maybe I just want to have myself a carrot, like I'm Bugs Bunny. Maybe two carrots? They don't really do much for you. <laughs> just have a straight up beat as well. I'm hardcore. Alright, let's come on down over here. I guess we have to expand our bunker here, because we ain't gonna put any soil here and have my workbench area at the same place, so... I guess it works below us as well. Build. Do I have to build another ladder to go down? I imagine we probably do as well. So that's gonna be more metal maybe required and more wood? I guess we'll cross that bridge once we get there. So that's one. And, uh, I... yeah. Sure. Build. Unless we can just grab this ladder and put it down here. It'd be kind of like cheating, but... I mean, at some point or another, we're gonna have to make another ladder, obviously. But for now, I suppose we could just... Grab you, right? Yeah. I'm stuck now here, in case you're wondering. I, there's no, no way for me to get out. If I lose this ladder down here, it's game over for me. But... It works enough for that. And we have lamps still, so that's good. Um, I guess that's cool. Sure. I'm gonna put it lower just because it's gonna be like soil area anyway, so it doesn't really have to be too high up. And same over here. Okay. Now put your soil down. Uh, what I like about this, what I like about the UI is just a simple grab and drag now, so I'm okay with this. It's actually a fairly good little system. I only have enough for four, boys. I mean, can I just... <laughs> Fine, I have one over here. I have my own little personal soil thing up here. Perfect. Now we just go ahead and what do we want to grow? Well, this one's going to be obviously beets, just because... It gives me the office reference all the time, so... Plant? Sure. Oh, we require water. Well, luckily for you... I received some water earlier. I was wondering what that was for, now we figured it out. Carrot seeds. So now we come over here and we will do... Carrot. Plant. I'll water you soon, don't worry. And we'll do... Carrot. Plant. We'll do cabbages over here, just have a little bit of nice, um... A little nice spread of everything. And... Uh, cabbage seed. Mm-hmm. And, oh, right. Click you first. And cabbage. Alright. Plants need water and light to grow. Like... I guess our regular lights work? You can take some water from a sink. I, I've done that before already. Keep your farm room well lit. More light, faster growth. Hmm. So I guess we probably only have access to these, right? Because it's like a demo, but probably eventually you could probably make like better lamps, like actual sun lamps. But for now, <laughs> the simple walnuts will have to do. Food source established, I'll check my plan again. Indeed you will. Let's come up here and, um... Let's not talk about the fact that we are indeed stuck down here, right? Hey, okay. Can you at least make it up to that level? And read. Hmm? How can I escape? Ah. Car, plane, rocket... No, that's just crazy. It's a little crazy. Oh, that's not how to escape. We don't escape by you telling me thank you for playing the demo. If you want to try to survive in a bunker and live the Prepper story, we encourage you to visit Mr. Prepper's full game Steam page situated right there. And for you guys watching, I'll have the link for you in the description down below. This is indeed the demo. It's available to you guys as well. If you guys want to check it out for yourself, see if there's anything else you can kind of mess around with. But so far, I'm definitely getting the sheltered vibes, and that's perfectly fine. I'll catch you guys next time.